Can you can you just get in the frame just to give everyone a perspective, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> So good afternoon everyone, it's Thursday before Christmas coming, what the date is now, so we're literally sort of starting to wind down, clean the workshop and stuff, so isn't really much to show you on this one, really. Um, as far as things that have been done, um, the BBR Turbo Mark 2.5 um, came in, I think might have been on the previous video, for some brake lines, some bits and pieces that Ashley was doing. That's all been done. Um, the black one, I was waiting for some coil packs to come. They haven't arrived, which is unfortunate. I ordered them on Monday. And the, I'll get this colour wrong, I thought it was uh, black cherry, but it's something, um, I have to speak to Ashley what colour it is, but this has all been put back together and customers coming to pick this up Saturday. So I've got to come in, oh, and this one as well. So waiting for tyres on this, hopefully they'll come. If it's not, then I'm not sure whether that's going to be leaving. But hopefully the supercharged one, so this one, that one, and that one, hopefully be gone. But I don't think the one with the misfire is because waiting for those coil packs to come in. Well, that's about it really what's going on out what's been done uh, not much came in at the weekend so not not much to do there so let's go and see and again what there's not much not much really have you right gareth Roy's well, got his coffee. Got my coffee. So, as you can see, there's not a lot going on. That is not. <laughs> Clean. So that's, the car that's on Roy's ramp is the sealed one that we got for sale. So that's up there out the way. And Roy's just been having a general tidy up. Does look a lot tidier, Roy, doesn't it? I'm rearranging stuff, yeah. Organising. So busy during the year. I work too fast. I don't get a chance to tidy up. So. Does, does look better over here. It'd be nicer when it's painted. Not really much to talk about, is it? Not really. Look. We're all just mulling around drinking coffee. Now, Ollie's on the Ollie. Ollie's back on the, uh, on the channel. On, on the channel. Oil. <laughs> I'm making return. <laughs> he got bored and wanted to come in and say hello. Mm. No, he makes, uh, now he makes the get coffee. Get a break from, yeah. He's now coffee. Instead of H2O. I, I would, yeah, I won't say that. <laughs> 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 what, what, what was it? Co oh, did he just make the coffee, did he? Yeah, he just made the coffee, yeah. Oh. Still on my uses. <laughs> so, yeah, there's not a lot really going on. You waiting on a call? Yeah. So you're tidying up as well, aren't you, Ash? Yeah. Nothing to work on here, is there? Well, there is actually on, on that one. There is potentially a lot of work on that one, isn't there? But that's uh, that's that's for another episode in the new year. Yeah. So what, have you, what, so what have you done so far then? What have I done so far? I've put some stuff on the floor and... Yeah. Hi, so it, it makes a change. I, I can't help feeling that everyone watching this video is going to think that either you've uh, got very big or something's shrunk. Small, far away. It's, it's the cold weather, don't worry about it. It happens to all of us. So, Ash, so Ashley is just trying to tidy up. I still, I still notice that that's still there, though. What's that? This, all this. What, my undertrack? This yeah, just just all this dirt and everything here. That's you've you've missed a bit. That, that's not dirt. That's my pile of parts for my car that I haven't got around to fitting. <laughs> Camouflage themselves with the rest of the workshop. What are they anyway? I know they're shocks. The gas. They're gas ones, aren't they? Yeah. You got to get them repaired at all. I think it's good to sell them. Oh, okay. Anyone that's interested in a very nice clean set of gas, yep. give Ashley a shout. 
No rust, no dust. <laughs> no rust, no dust. Fair enough. So I, um, what have I been doing? So for the past two days while everyone's been sort of tidying up and bits and pieces, I've been working on a car which has been sitting in the car park for a while, which if anyone noticed, it wasn't there. Um, and just before lunch, managed to get it running. So I don't know if the owner of this watches the channel, but I will be contacting him just before Christmas. But yeah, it was good. So what we've got going on in here is, um, oh, let me explain this actually. So the guy came in and bought an engine off of us, I think it was early in the year, or it might have been the year before, I can't remember, but to go in is 1.6 Mark 2.5, but it's a 1.8 engine. Um, there was, when he, when he came to buy the engine, he, he initially said Mark II, so he ended up getting a Mark II engine, but it obviously wasn't ideal because he needed a Mark 2.5. Um, it was being put together somewhere else, um, but the last few bits on it meant that there was a lot of things within the wiring that needed to be changed and a few alterations, so it came back to us. So what I've had to do was, obviously being on a Mark 2.5, it has a non-return fuel system, and on the Mark II, uh, fuel rail it has a return system on it so I managed to find a non-return fuel rail and fitted it on here and then I came into the issue of the top of the manifold not fitting so I just had to notch that a little bit um, change a couple of bits of the wiring and fitted the ME221 and just before lunch got it working it fired up anyway Did it? yeah but it's a couple of seconds. no no it, it was running but I've got an issue with number two fuel injector. It's not putting fuel in. So it's, I think, I think it's just a sticky injector. So I've got to take that off. Try that. And then that will be it for this year. But it's running. And so he'll be pleased with that. And there's just gauges. Uh, let's have a look. So he's got, he's got wide band. So we've put the, we've put the O2 sensor in. So there's all these gauges have got to be fitted. So there's some other bits and pieces to do, but I just essentially wanted to get it running before the Christmas period. So let's go and see what's happening on, uh... so what are you doing in the workshop then anyway, well, new boy? Well, <laughs> you know, I didn't want to be let loose on anything too, too. So what's this you're working on then? Well, it's, um, it looks very small. No, no, you're mistaken. It's not small at all. Can you, can you just get in the frame just to give everyone a perspective maybe? <laughs> <laughs> so what's this, uh, so what are you working on here then, Gareth? Well, it's a... Uh, what's this in for? Can you just run me through what it is well, you're doing? Kind of, kind of bodywork assembly, really. Yeah. Yep. But, um, but the wheels, I'm having a problem with the wheels, actually. I'm so Gareth has actually just bought himself a new car. Yeah, well, I don't know if I've travelled, do I? So, <laughs> and I thought I'd be green, you know, yep. and get, get, an electric, get an electric car. Um, couldn't afford a Tesla. So how many so, how many horsepower is this? Do you know? It's uh, half a horsepower. Half a horsepower. Yeah. 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 So, oh, I noticed the the T6 badge there. Yeah. Yeah. All wheel drive as well. Look, apparently. All wheel drive. Yeah. Let's just pull that off. Of there. Okay. Oh, See, feel, new, feel new car stick, new, new new car stickers. Yeah, that's it. That's the one. It's good, don't it? I like it. It's got stereo. Look. Got, let me let me look. No, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to lie again. It'll take forever. <laughs> <laughs> Hang on a minute. That in the background. All <laughs> <laughs> right. Yeah. So we got we got stereo. Look, putting your own MP3 in, into there. Look. <laughs> Steering wheel. Obviously needs assembly. Yeah. Some assembly required. That looks like it's only what five wires or something like that. Yeah, three wires. Well, I don't know. I don't know. I think that might be horn or something. But yeah. Shift a look. Okay. Yeah. High speed, low speed lights. So yeah, getting excited. Nice, isn't it? Let's just do it. What's the under, underneath light? That's no, quite. No. That's quite aerodynamic, isn't it? Yeah. There's not much rust yeah, on this. Dynamic slide, is it? No. You can underseal it. That's pretty clean. I don't know what that's about. What's that about? Oh, that's for storage, isn't it? Is it? Yeah. So you can put them down. Put them down. Did you know they're not wheelie bars? Oh no no. So they, that's drag. That's, yeah. That's, that's drag. Bars. That's for the power. So it doesn't tip. No, it's got a handle on the other side. So you can pull it along. 
they're weedy bars. They're probably yeah. doing up. They're weedy bars, they are. Anyway, I've got to concentrate on this, so just, just leave me alone on there, because I, I, might, um, I might get confuzzled. Swedish technology. <laughs> Isn't it? You're missing a wheel here, though. Uh, I see it's very this is, is this your drive wheel? They both drive. It's got uh, dual, dual motor, this one. Dual motor. <laughs> is that your locking wheel nut key? Well, it comes with its own high-speed Formula One style removal tool. But um, I think this is a lock nut. I think it's spinning a spindle around this side, so I'm just going to turn it. It's not actually doing that. Are you qualified to do this? Probably not. You need to put it in the park. Ah, oh, oh, you need yes. to put it in park. Because yes. you're turning all the drive train, aren't you? Well, it's on the keys, I can't open the door. Oh, it's in park. Fine. Okay, yeah. nice car, Gareth. Are you going to take it for a spin in the workshop? I doubt it, because I think I should probably break it. No, if... if then I'll have very important... Then I'll have very important... It's not actually working. you got the right size socket on that. Is that too big? Oh. No, I think that's actually as far as it's supposed to go. You sure? Yeah. Have you over tightened those? Did you not tighten them into the correct tightening torque, Gareth? Oh, I shall be checking the torque, obviously. I am a professional. Right, right. Well, there's not much for me point chatting to you, is there, Jim? Other than other than Jim has rearranged his area. So, so we've now moved. So this cupboard here was where Jim's toolbox was, and his bench was there. So we've tidied this general area up a bit more, which is better. Right. Well, I think I've stretched this. So you've managed to stretch out. Oh yes, oh yeah, Jim's been hard at work as well in the workshop, so we up there. Quiet on set. <laughs> that's, Jim, that's Jim's job to be annoying and, and noisy. <laughs> so Jim's been hard at work this week putting one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve brackets up. I think he's been you've done other stuff this week, Jim though, haven't you? Other than <laughs> right, does anyone want to say happy? Ha hope you had, everyone had a good Christmas then. It's going out after Christmas. Ready? Hope, yeah, yeah. Well, hope, say, hope they've had this is hard work. Just say, hope you had a good Christmas and see you in the new year. Christmas. See you in the Yay! I hope you guys got that. So, if if it's coming out after Christmas, hope you had a good Christmas. We'll see you in the new year. We've got some things plant uh, planted, planned for next year, which is going to make the channel more exciting. And it's going to happen slowly, but it is going to it's going to happen next year. So, see you in the new year. Hope you have a good one and. Bye-bye.